I'm Ty Quinones. Right now in your 13 Action News update, the principal at Wright Elementary School says students were approached by a man on Thursday. A letter sent to parents says that students were getting off a school bus near Durango and Blue Diamond when the man came up to them. He then reportedly asked for hugs and the kids ran away. The principal says that this serves as an opportunity to remind students of safe practices when walking to and from school. Well, a program that aims to reduce domestic violence related homicides is now expanding across Las Vegas. Police and SafeNest making that announcement today. Project Safe 417 will now be at all 10 Metro Police Department command centers. The initiative is designed to bridge the gap from officers' responses to the time when a person receives some crisis services. Project 417 first launched in December of 2017. Well, two new lawsuits have now been filed against the Alpine Motel Apartments and its owner. In December, six people died and 13 others were injured in a fire at the downtown Las Vegas property. The lawsuits were filed on behalf of the estate of two of the victims. Sunny skies and breezy winds for your Monday or Tuesday. Wind speed picks up even more, but through tonight the sky will stay clear and the wind will actually taper off through dinner time. Temperatures are going to dip to the 40s overnight into your Tuesday morning with afternoon highs tomorrow capped cooler than where we landed today. Forecast highs just in the low 60s. That coupled with sustained wind 10 to 20 and gusts up to 30 is going to make for a pretty cool feel. And keep in mind there will be a lake wind advisory for the Lake Mead Re Recreation Area starting first thing Tuesday morning with gusts approaching 40 miles per hour. Danny, thank you. That was your 13 Action News update. Remember, you could always get the latest news at KTNV.com. Thank you for making 13 Action News part of your day.